Factsverse presents 15 Everyday Things You've Been Doing Wrong Number 1. You're eating your hamburger the wrong way. Most people will use their four fingers to hold the top of their hamburger and their thumbs to hold the bottom of their hamburger. If you're eating your hamburger this way, you're eating it wrong. When you hold your hamburger with your thumb and pinky finger at the bottom and the rest of your fingers on top, your burger won't slip out of the bun. When you make your burger, you should put your condiments underneath the burger so that they don't leak out each time you take a bite. And you should also put the lettuce, tomatoes, onions, and pickles under the burger so they don't overpower the taste of the meat. The only thing that you should be putting on top of your burger is the cheese and the bun. Number 2. You've been hulling your strawberries wrong. When you make jam or jelly with fresh strawberries, you need to hull them first. Most people will cut around the strawberry stem to prepare the strawberry. This can be really time-consuming. If you're making jam or jelly, you'll likely need to hull several pounds of strawberries. The best way to do this is the fastest way. You should take a straw and push it up the bottom of the strawberry. The stem and the white part will pop right out. It'll make the jam-making process much quicker. Number 3. You've been cutting your mango wrong. Most people will try to peel their mango and then cut it. This can be difficult and time-consuming. Also, you can end up losing a great deal of your fruit when you're peeling it. The best way to cut a mango is to chop it into cubes before peeling it. Start by cutting the mango down the side next to the pit. Then cut down the other side. You should end up with three pieces. Next, make lengthwise and crosswise cuts in the mango. Take the peel side and turn it inside out. The cut pieces of mango will stick out, making them easy to cut away. This way, you won't lose any mango in the peel. Number 4. You're doing push-ups wrong When you were taught to do push-ups as a child, you used your back and your butt to pull yourself up. This is a mistake. A push-up is meant to work your arms and your core. When you do a push-up properly, you should keep your back and your butt straight and use your arms and your abs to push yourself off the ground. At no point should your back ever bend. Number 5. You're doing squats wrong and wasting your time. If you're doing squats and your butt is sticking out, you're doing it wrong. Doing an exercise wrong will only waste your time because you'll not get the optimal results. When doing squats, you should bend until your thighs are parallel to the ground. This will ensure that you're working all of the parts of the body that you should be working. Number 6. Are you applying your moisturizer properly? The best way to have soft, younger-looking skin is to moisturize. If you're not moisturizing properly, your skin will not be as soft and youthful as it could be, and you're wasting bottles and bottles of moisturizer. When applying your moisturizer, you should tap it on, don't rub it in. It's most effective when you pat it on damp skin. Next, wait until the moisturizer dries before putting on your makeup. When you give it the time to absorb, it'll be more effective. Finally, don't ignore your neck. Your neck needs the moisturizer just as much as your face does. Number 7. Are you tying your shoes properly? There is a right way and a wrong way to tie your shoes. Chances are you've been tying yours wrong. If you tie your shoes and the loops are vertical, they will likely come untied quickly. Your loops should be horizontal and there should be a loop on each side of the foot. Number 8. You're working too hard to peel those potatoes. Peeling potatoes can be a time-consuming task, especially if you need to peel lots of potatoes. Rather than pulling out your potato peeler and getting blisters on your fingers, you can easily peel them without ever holding a potato peeler at all. Start by boiling a pan of water and drop the potatoes in. Next, carefully remove the potatoes from the boiling water and place them in ice water. The cold water will pull the skin away from the potato. Number 9. Fold your slacks and save the crease. If you want to keep the crease in your slacks, there's a right way and a wrong way to fold them. Start by pulling your creases out and bringing them together. Next, fold the pants lengthwise in half, and then in half again. This will keep your crease when they're in your drawer. Number 10. Make a BLT the right way. When most people make a BLT, they lay a few slices of bacon over the top of the lettuce and tomato, and then they eat it. This method will leave you with several bites where you'll have no bacon at all. You should make a lattice with your bacon strips. This means laying the strips going across and down. This will ensure a piece of bacon in every bite. Number 11. Painting your nails is more than random strokes. Many bottles of nail polish have directions that most people ignore. You should start by placing a drop of nail polish at the bottom of the nail and push it close to the cuticle but leave a gap. Next, brush one side up to the tip. Next, push the middle of the polish to the tip, and finally push the last side to the tip. If you need a second or third coat, wait until the first coat is dry. 
Number 12. Clean your blender properly. Most people will use their blender and then wash it after. This can be dangerous because the blades in the blender are sharp. The best way to clean a blender is to fill it with hot water and dish soap, then blend. This will get all the stuck-on foods and liquids out of the blades. The best part is that you won't hurt yourself. Number 13. Bread ties. Use a soda bottle to close the bags. If you open a bag of something but have no bread ties to close it later, you can use an empty soda bottle. Simply cut the top of the bottle about 4 or 5 inches down. Pull the top of the plastic bag through the bottle's hole. This will keep the bag closed until you need it again. Number 14. You're wearing your earbuds the wrong way. Most people have been wearing their earbuds wrong, and they don't even know it. If you're like most people, you'll put the earbuds in your ears and allow the wire to hang down and connect to your phone or iPod. When you do this, the device that the earbuds are connected to puts weight on those earbuds, causing them to pop out of your ears. If you put your earbuds in and wrap them up and over the backside of your ear, the cord will stay secure and in position because your ear is keeping the pressure off the earbuds. Number 15. Eating Chinese food is easier than you may have thought. This is the one that is so obvious, but most people don't know about it. Most people order their takeout Chinese food, go home, and put it in a bowl or plate to eat. Most people order their takeout Chinese food, go home, and put it in a bowl to eat. What most people don't know is that's not necessary. The takeout carton itself can actually be turned into a plate. By opening the carton at the folds, the whole thing will open up into a plate to enjoy your food on without dirtying a dish.